news here from the Chicago Bears. They have signed former Philadelphia Eagles Super Bowl winning tight end Trey Burton to a four-year deal, $32 million, um, according to Ian Rappaport, Adam Scheffner, all these guys, Mike Garoppolo. So again, another big piece the, in the Bears' continued efforts to improve their offense. They get another target to go along with Allen Robinson and Cameron Meredith to help improve uh, Mitchell Trubisky's situation. They're really gearing to um, really compete, to, to have an offense that will compete with the uh, rest of the NFC North, especially now that the Vikings potentially have Kirk Cousins. Um, it's a big deal. It is a very big deal because, um, you know, that the, the Bears are kind of really in the bottom tier of this NFC North, and they got a new weapon now in Trey Burton, who is kind of underrated and undervalued, at least, in Philadelphia. He is a very good receiving tight end, very tall, very strong uh, athletic tight end. He had a very strong market, but he is going to get an $8 million a year contract from the Chicago Bears, kind of the same deal that Cameron Brake got from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. But, uh, you know, Cameron Bridge better in my opinion. Uh, <laughs> um, but, yeah, again, very big piece of um, offensive weaponry for Mitchell Trubisky. Again, it's all about getting weapons for Mitchell Trubisky and helping him in his development. Obviously, last year it was kind of a rough situation with Mike Lennon, and Trubisky kind of got thrown into the fire and did okay. He could have done a lot worse. But um, now that he's getting some more offensive weapons around him, you need to improve that offensive line if you're the Chicago Bears. And you you do have some pieces on defense, but I feel you need to get some um, younger pieces in there. And then you'd be, I feel that you'd be ready to at least compete for a wild card spot. You know, you still have teams like the Detroit Lions. Um, yeah, obviously, you have uh, the 49ers to compete with, the, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, the Atlanta Falcons. The, the, the NFC is a very stacked conference in my opinion there's a lot of teams that could compete for those wild card spots but i feel the bears are doing a good job in making themselves be able to compete better um alan robinson was a huge pickup for them and now they get trey burton as well um again i'm really liking the moves that ryan pace is making um in terms of just getting mitchell trubisky the pieces he needs to be able to succeed now um you need to focus on that interior and exterior offensive line um and to a certain degree um, uh, get some more pieces on defense, but that offensive line is huge. You don't have Josh sitting anymore. Like I said, your tackle position is kind of shaky. Um, I kind of like Charles Leno, um, but you still have Kyle Long there as well. Um, again, the interior offensive line, I feel is a very strong suit for the bears, but I feel it does need some work and I feel that they are going to address this move. But right now, Ryan Pace and the Bears are making a lot of very decent moves, in my opinion, and they've added another offensive firepower piece with Trey Burton. But again, um, let me know what you guys think about the video. Bears fans, if you're new, don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you enjoy the move. And let me know, do you like the move? Do you hate the move? Uh, again, let me know down in the comments section below. I'm going to be trying to keep you guys up to date as much as I can throughout uh, the free agency period. I'm going to be making videos uh, at least until 2 p.m. So yeah, hope you guys all enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. But until then, goodbye for now, guys. See ya.